Hello everyone, it's Debbie, and I'm just doing a little clean here. I am, I bought these at my local grocery store, and these are just alcohol wipes. That's what it says. Yeah, they do smell a little bit like alcohol, but not, not a lot. So, I like to use them to clean off my workstation. <laughs> I had that glitter mat on there. And, oh my God, I've been cleaning up glitter from just everywhere. Goodness, look at the glitter. Oh, that's okay. I'm still vacuuming glitter from Christmas. Here, I just wanted to get this nice and cleaned up. I think my camera is a little crooked. Keeps wanting to go sideways. I had those little pieces of what happened to that other one I had? I've got two here. I had one with snowflakes on it. <clears throat> oh, and may have ended up getting into the I'm just going to put them inside there. <laughs> there. Whoop. Woo. Made everything move, didn't I? Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So, I hope everyone's doing fine today. There. I think I got everything cleaned off. Maybe. <laughs> oh. Yeah. <clears throat> I've been thinking about painting my nails. I'm kind of clean my little jar here. Yeah, I have been thinking about cleaning my jar. I meant cleaning my jar. Oh my god. I don't think I needed to make a video today because my brain is in neutral. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, I didn't mean to put them over there just yet. I'm going to put me some paper towels down here to kind of help there maybe that I'll make everything show up better I used to use a white towel but I was so scared of getting I don't know white uh, or a polish on my white hand towels so And I'm not a wasteful person, that's for sure. I'm very frugal. Except when it comes to, to spoiling myself on occasion. But for the most part, I am pretty frugal. Now, I have all the brushes and things over here. I'm out of my... Uh, thing so i'm gonna jump off here and i might paint some of these nails and uh, see how i like it i don't want to do it on camera because I'll, I'll save a couple and then i'll do them and but i'll be back soon okay everyone this is going to be a pretty boring video because all i'm doing is just going through my little uh, thing here that I keep all my little tools in close at hand. This actually was an air 
you know, you got those little sticks and you stuck it up and put water in it. That's what that was. And I just thought when I got done with all the little air freshener sticks and the liquid, I was like, hmm, I don't want to get rid of it or throw it away. And I got to thinking, oh yeah, that would be great. And this is my <laughs> handmade brush that I use to dust off any acrylic. And this is my... Of course, I don't really do gemstones, but in like the little wax picker upper and the little... I'm not sure if this is for using on foils. Not sure what that end is. Or, uh, hmm. <sighs> and I'm really not an artiste, that's for sure. Not that I haven't tried, but yes, I don't, I don't practice as, probably as much as I should because, um, I guess when things kind of fail, I get discouraged, and I know, they say practice, practice, practice. I know that. I know it. I just, as I said, I get a little down in the dumps. Hmm. There's a little, there's a little brush. I was going to get. I keep a toothpick in here in case I want to do little dots, but I got dotting tools, so I really don't know why I need here. Or I use it for stirring, but I'll stick it back down in there. Uh, I'm looking for that one little brush. I just I thought I left it laying out here. Hmm. Well, where'd it go? Let me look at my trash can. Make sure it didn't. Well, not in there. <laughs> well, below me down. Hmm. Where did it go? It's kind of like this one, but it's really thin. Thin, thin, thin. My goodness, that is something. Huh. Well, no, that's a dotting tool. Well, do I have to go through this again? <laughs> and I think I might try out my, um, yeah, these. I'm going to try those out as soon as I find my other little brush. Oh my god, I'm going to have to take everything back out so I can find it. There it is. It's stuck in the middle. Ugh. Stuck in the middle with you. Stuck in the middle with you. <laughs> oh goodness. Now, get all that back down in there. Now, actually, those are too big. Uh -huh. This fan brush, definitely, because I will use it. Oh, yeah, that's the one I use for little dips, that nail. Okay. Hmm. 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 Well, there. Let me put down in there, a little, see that little piece of skin there, it's been bugging me, there, I think I got it, okay, now, uh -uh. now, first thing I'm going to do, Yes. Get these out. And 
This is not going to be a nail design. It's just going to be a little practice thing to see what kind of lines each one of those make. And, uh, yeah. I wish I had, like, a really long stiletto nail. All I have is... Let's see, I use them. Up. I still have these on those little stands. My little snowman from Christmas. And, <clears throat> and those from New Year's. Seems like in my pictures... Oh, damn. Seems like in my pictures they just did not show up. Oh, yes. I heard someone say, which I've heard a lot of the nail people talk about, is making an X or some kind of dot right in the middle, which would be, according to mine, would be like right there. Because my camera thing is like right here, as you can see, and I hate that. I like ones that are in the middle. Why they always have to make it to the side? The outer, you know. Okay. Now. Oops. Okay. Lay them back down there. Let's see. Let me find... Uh... uh da -da 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 -da. I'll just use, I don't, oh, this has got glitter in it, but I just want to put a dab of nail polish. Let's see, I'm trying to look in my camera. There, that should be the middle. There, 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 there. <laughs> there. So, I've tried various things, but I'm going to try that. <laughs> that looks nasty and messy, don't it? I don't really like that. Oh, well. <laughs> it is what it is. There. Now, let's see. Doing. Boing, boing. Okay. Let me get one of those out. And I am going to paint. Let's see. Let me. Oh, I need to find another one of those nails. Let me pause and get myself together here. And then I will be right back. Whoop. Okay, leave it up to me to stick my finger into the black polish, right? Yeah, of course. It would not be one of my videos if I did not make a mess. <laughs> Thank goodness. It, gosh, it's not coming off. Let me get some. Oh my God, I'm getting it all, all over me. I think that was a bad idea. I should have went with a pen or pencil mark, shouldn't I have? God, is that all of it? I hope so. <clears throat> I am going to toss these nails. I don't I don't save my I mean I know a lot of people do, but I don't because well I just don't. <laughs> Although I I have a hard time getting rid of my snowman. I just I think that one I might keep. I know he, he's he's sure not perfect. And if it hadn't been for those glasses, I would have never been able to do that. I cannot do that fine detail for sure. So, let's get one of those off of there. And I am going to... You know what? Instead of... I was going to paint the nail black. I think I am going to start with... Okay. If I set everything close to that dot, I know what I should do. It's kind of there. I'm gonna get my big head in the way. Mm. 
Okay. Close up my. Okay. We're going to paint this a pink. And then I think I might use red as the. You know what? What I like to do is. I like to buff the shine off these. Actually, I can do it right here. I just like buffing to get a little bit of that shine off. Just so. Get that in where that, that little icky tab thing. There. That's all we need. Okay. Whoop. And. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this yeah I didn't I'm not going to bother with a base coat because this is just a <laughs> oh my gosh what is it with me and getting nail polish all over me <laughs> oh yeah is a nice pink. This is Madame Glam's and this is perfect pink which that's what I'm thinking about painting oh. painting my nails is perfect pink and I think I'm going to do a matte, a matte top coat over top of them. Now for anyone that's used any of these peel-off base coats, you know what? I have used them, and I cannot get, you know, like, peel it back off for nothing and under the sun. It is just, no. It's, to, for me, they do not work. And I see other people use them, so why do they call it? I know it's supposed to stick good enough, but if it's a peel-off base coat, shouldn't you be able to take something like, like this with this little sharp... I, I don't know what this came out of, something I've had for years and years and years. And I mean, several times I started to throw this little thing away, and I don't know. I mean, some things that I, I will keep forever. I am... Kind of cinema. I probably have had that since I was in my early 30s. Ha ha ha. Now I'm. Woo. Before I know it, I'll be hitting 60. There. Second coat of perfect pink. Put it over here into the lamp. There. Now, ah, I should have tried that on there and see if I could have peeled it off. <laughs> Probably would have worked. I wonder if you need a shiny coat in under your nails. Hmm. I don't know. But I might try this here in a little bit when I go to do my nails. So, oh, yes. Uh, let me find my... No. goodness I'm <laughs> I keep hitting my camera let me stand up here and try to find my yes let's see yeah, I think 
I'm going to use red on with these. Ooh, so I can see yeah how they work after I get red all over the bottle. I really like cleaning those if I possibly can to keep it from gumping up <laughs> gooping gooping gumpy gumpy gooping you know what I mean getting all icky around the tops of the bottles so let's see there we go now what I am going to do is let me put those out of the way and I was kind of torn between this pink on a uh, lot of ones are doing my nail mono pink I, I'm not sure how you pronounce that let me see if I can get it up here into the camera focus that color pink I started to do my nails that I'm not sure yet but where I have I know most people think these are my natural nails, but no, these are those cheap little white tips that you buy from, what, what brand is that, Kiss, the Kiss brand? Yeah, Kiss brand. You get one of these little things and it has those tips. I love those. If you want just a natural looking nail, Go to your local department store and try to find a KISS uh, dipping kit. And they have those in them. I meant, I really like them. I meant, that's just my opinion. But, anyway. <laughs> okay. Now, on to trying out my new artist brushes. And... And whenever I do any more dips, I will try these dip liquids to see how they work. Which will probably be a while before I even do that. Let's see. I am going to... No, I'm not going to use that little... Everything fell down back there. I'm trying to I'm trying to get everything back in order. Okay. Oh, let me put that back down in there. I <laughs> didn't need it out. I'm just going to put a little dab. Ah! After I pour it all over the place. Debbie. Yes. Do that. That was good. Okay. <laughs> After I poured it all over the place. Oh, did I get it on the nail? No, it just went underneath there. Okay. Oh my God, I'm so messy. That's why I don't like to video myself doing my own nails. Most of it. I'll save like one and do it because I am pure messy. Okay, now. I am just going to do lines across with each one of these. Now, oops, and I'm going to leave those little plastic things off. I know some of them say put them back on, but you know what? I figure once they're inside this lid, you know, you don't, you don't need it. And I don't even know where that went. There it is. <laughs> where it went flying to. Okay, now. And yes, I'm going to look how fast that acetone is drying. Woo! Okay. Now. Am I totally staying in view? <laughs> Let's see. Let's start. Down here. Let me, let me put my glasses on. Hold on. I've got to have them. Or I'll end up making a lot. Well... I'm not going to say they're not going to look like lightning bolts, but they probably will. Okay. 
Here we go. Oh, my hand. There. <laughs> I'm telling you people, I have no, none at all. I shake too bad to Okay, I'll be right back. Let me go answer my phone. Okay, I'm back. Why is it the phone always rings when you're you're busy? Or mine? <laughs> mine does. Okay, I need some way of steadying my hand and some way of holding that. I'm telling you, people, I'm I'm so embarrassed that I cannot. I can't even try these out for people. To see how these work. Ugh. Well, I would say if you're a good artist, you know, I'm sure this would work. I'm just, like I said, not good at all. See how crooked that is? <laughs> oh my gosh. But, we're going to go with the flow, right? We're going to go with the flow. Okay. I'm just going to dip that brush. I'm going to clean them off. Might as well finish making this talon messy, right? Yeah. Then I'll put me a few clean ones down. <laughs> so... So that's that one. I meant, you know, like I said, I know I'm not an artist. I'm going to try to put these back in here without messing up the bristles. More bristles. I'll lay them over here. And uh, I wish I knew the numbers on these. I have no idea what they are. Oh, yes. Let's, let's cure that one for a few seconds. Just kind of settle everything. That way I'll be loading my brush. Maybe I put too much on my brush. Maybe I, I should just do the end of them. It, is that my problem? That I'm, I'm putting too much paint on them? I guess. Not. Okay. I just wanted to cure it enough that it won't move. So... If I can, if I can, <laughs> I'm going to try to do a line. Let me get down here. Let me try to balance my hand. I'm going to try. Like I said, people, I am not. Would that work better? Me balancing my hand. Yay. I'm not worried that it's, it's perfect looking. You know, because, like I said, I am not an artist. We're going to do each brush. <laughs> Clean it off. Okay. We're just, I think we're going to end up making a... As we call it here in the U.S., a plaid design. I know a lot of people call it tartan. But, I don't, you know, I guess to us it would probably translate to tartan. Right? Okay, now. This one right here seems to be really fine. So... I did fairly good by balancing my little pinky, holding real close to the end. <clears throat> I don't think I put enough paint on that one. Oh, I'm sorry if I'm... I'm trying to stay... Oh, Lord, that just... That went wacky. Didn't it? It sure did. 
Can I, can I clean that off? Ugh. I just don't want to totally, I think I'm messing the nail up. Okay. Let's try this again. <clears throat> there, <laughs> even though that's a little crooked, that's okay. That's okay. We're, I'm still learning, and like I said, I don't practice like I should because I guess I just don't have the enthusiasm. Mainly, I've done this just to be able. To do my own nails. That's that's the main reason for this. My channel. <laughs> and so my stepdaughter, Rachel, can see what's going on here where I live. Compared to where she lives. I love these with those crystals in them. Oh, I really like the clear ones. And I, I love it that each stone matches the color. I would have to say I'm at not being a, uh, a nail artist at all. I, I would actually give these artist brushes, this brand, I pronounce it Beetles. Beetles? Be, Beetles. 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 I guess. But I got these off Amazon. And, uh, yeah. I meant, I guess it, I give them a thumbs up because <clears throat> if I was very steady handed and stuff like that, I, I would say they would work wonderful. Okay, we've done a few across. Yeah. Let's try to do one up. Let's try to do one across. Oop. And I managed to do that. Put it down. There. Oh well, I didn't make it all the way to each each edge, but that's okay. That's okay. <laughs> And we have one more to try, folks. One more. But yeah, I, I really like those. I, I do. <clears throat> now, I'm not sure. Oh, this is that big long one. This is the one that doesn't like me. <laughs> yep. These kind, them big long ones. Okay. Let me get down here. Steady my hand. Let's see. We're going to go right down the middle. <laughs> Which ended up totally crossways, right? I just had to finish that up a little bit. Oh, ah, oh my God. Ah, Lord. Isn't that crazy? Like I said, whether I teach, well, I don't know if I'm teaching anybody anything. Maybe how to be silly. But anyway, yes, I, I'm I'm really impressed with these brushes. Really, really, really. Oh, there it is. Here, oh, I just oh, flash cards. I knock everything over. Okay, yeah. So, 
Yep, that is the Beatles brushes. <laughs> At first, I thought those were, I meant back when I first started watching people, that I thought that was where they stored some of their crystals that they used to decorate nails. And I realized, no, they're not not able to come out of there. That is just for um, to make them look a little bit more elegant and beautiful and fancy, as I call it, fancy. Okay, let me put them back in the box. And there, I am going to stand them up right back there, and that way I won't put them away in a drawer. <coughs> Okay, now, should I matte top coat it or should I gloss it? <laughs> it's kind of a mess. I'm going to take this brush. I, I've just got to finish this and there. Okay. Let me put that back in there. Let me clean this. There. Now. Ooh. Hmm. No. Actually, what I might add to that. Okay. I might add a few with this older brush I have. I might add just a few different pink stripes than the pink that's in the base. We will see, won't we? So, let's see. Let's come here and we will make one across. And we will make one down that way, which really isn't showing up, so I guess that was kind of a... I'm going to grab a little bit of that red there, and I'm going to make... See what kind of pink I can make here. <laughs> we'll do another line. Uh... Black right across here. All right. I don't know if that's even showing up because it's too too close to the pink that's already there. Oh. Okay. Now let me get this mess cleaned up. I am going to clean up this mess, and I will be right back. Okay, everyone, I'm back. So I got my little mess cleaned up, and I'm thinking I will matte top coat it first to see how it looks matted. And like I said, this is just, you know. Just practice. And, as I say, it's pretty poor practice. <laughs> right? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, that's the way it goes. <laughs> there. Now. Let me put my lid on there. Set that back there. Now let's cure it. Cure it for 30 seconds. We'll look at it, and then I will top coat gloss, a glossy top coat it. And this is Madam Glam's No Wipe Top Coat. So. Oh, okay. 
there it is nicely matte top coated all the way up let's see so yeah there it is oh matte top coated I'm trying to hold steady there and then I will gloss it and yeah I'll just toss this now because I don't like I said I don't save them because they're not really, they're not worth saving. Because, <laughs> like I said, I am not an artist, that's for sure. There. Now we will cure it for thirty seconds. I'll leave that one down. Oh, there they are. Let's bring those back over here. Okay. And there it is. Gloss. Actually, I think I liked it better matte. Seems like the gloss shows up my flaws on the nail. A lot worse, like I said, it is terrible. They're not straight. It is. Looks like a kindergartner did it, am I? No. <laughs> they could probably do better than me, that's for sure. So, that's all of it. And uh, if I decide to paint my nails, which I think I'm going to, um, I'll be back with just a clip of painting one nail. And I'll talk to you all again. Bye. Okay, everyone, I'm back. I painted this hand, perfect pink, and I matte top coated it. So I saved one nail to, to do. So, first we're going to, oh, this is going to be hard because I'm going to keep it in shot. Oh, so I don't mess this one up. And I did put the peel-off base coat on there. I'm only putting one coat, I meant, because since I'm matte top coating it. Now, I'm going to take this little tiny brush and... I am going to go around the edges. I try not to get up there too close. Just a little bit of a 
Hmm. I'm going to get that off my skin. If I can. <laughs> there. Okay. Now, I did take a dab off the side of the nail. I had to. Okay, now I'm going to cure that. Look at it again, up close. Okay. Seems like I find that matte top coating seems to hide any imperfections. I don't know why, or I think so. And then we will matte top coat it. And then we will be done. And I'll go wash my hands and probably upload this video after a while. <laughs> now Here we go. Now, make sure I put my lids on. And tighten them down. Make sure I didn't mess up my nail. Okay. Now. I thought about since this was a little bit different pink, doing like one of my nails this color, I haven't decided. But if I do, I won't do that on camera. I'll do that off and... So, <clears throat> clean up my little mess there, get that all rubbed off. There. Oops, I see a little spot there where I didn't get my matte top coat on. Uh, I always like to go around now. Yeah, it's this in here. I like to check the edges. A little spot right there. On that one. I don't know how I missed it, but there. <laughs> Get them in there real quick. So, I hope I gave you a little laugh for the day, and uh, I'll put this up, and uh, yeah. Let me put that back away. in the wrong spot. No wonder it didn't want to fit. 
Actually, while I am on camera, I might just paint one and see how it looks. And if I don't like it, then I can just rub it off. Right? Oop. <laughs> there we go. Let's see. Let's try it on this one, shall we? Oh, actually. It doesn't look that much different. Well. I thought it was going to be a totally different shade. I mean, it's a little lighter, but yeah. No. That's not... Alright. rib around these and I'm going to get off here and go wash my hands because I do not want to get a uh, oh. I need to clean my little brush get all that paint out of it here. Yeah, I saw, um, I, I'm, I really don't know their name, but uh, I promise. <laughs> I see their videos, and and yeah, she always puts a little dab down and goes around the edge. Actually, you could do that first, in case you did goof up. And then you could, uh, yeah. Then you could finish painting, get away from the cuticle. So, yeah, I know they're not perfect. Like I said, I'm still learning. Yeah. So. Yep. Yeah. Like I said, I'm still learning. I'm, I'm not that good yet. I'm still getting there. My biggest problem with, is with around my cuticle area for sure so i will talk to you all again on another video have a blessed day or rest of the week bye